focus. Focus can be the difference between on and off, winning and losing, good and great, between great and the best. Focusing can be the most self-fulfilling thing you could do for yourself because with focus comes accomplishment. Focusing can bring out your greatest talents and give you true purpose in this world. It could take your natural ability and magnify it to extraordinary. One thing I learned, and I'm sure most of us know, is what you focus on, what you put your energy into, is exactly what we should expect back. That's just the law of the universe, karma. I've seen it happen like 10,000 times. It's as proven as one plus one being two. Focus is a key to being successful in any situation. If you focus on the wrong, you'll get the wrong things. There's no way to focus on one thing and expect something different. How you focus on something is giving your attention to it. Even if you don't like it and still focus on not liking it, you're still putting your attention to it and will still attract it. For example, if you focus on wanting a new car, you'll keep attracting the idea of wanting a new car. But see, it's easy to confuse that because wanting a new car isn't the way to manifest it. You're simply just wanting a new car, not obtaining a new car. Remember, the intent of your focus is so important. There's a difference between focusing on wanting the new car and focusing on the car being yours. We really should be clear on what we focus on. Honestly, I feel like time is the most valuable thing we've ever been given, and focus runs parallel to that. Because every second of the day, we're focused on something, whether you realize it or not. I, for sure, am a victim of focusing on the wrong thing sometimes. I spent a little too much time on my phone, looking at comments, focusing on the outfit a little too long, but that's just human. It's very rare that you'll probably focus 100% of your time on what you need to. But the biggest advantage is to quickly catch yourself and be able to reset your focus. For me, there's no way I could focus on something I don't love, at least not for long. I'm just not content with spending my life miserable, and I just personally can't live like that. If it's not a part of your vibration, you could tell how you feel, your inner guidance system, your feelings. If I feel good, I'm doing the right thing. If not, then it's not what I'm supposed to be doing. How does what you focus on make you feel? Remember, it's never too late or too early to know what makes you happy and to make that change by any means necessary. I went into my last album, Focus. I wanted to focus on making music that would change people's lives, help lift their moods up, music that I felt was undeniably great to me, and talk about what directly affected me. And that's what I did. I never focused so much on executing these things while making music. And what do you know? My first number one album and my most successful one yet. You can't measure success in anything but happiness. I say that all the time. And if you focus your energy on what makes you happy, what do you think will happen? Exactly. It'll always work out. Rewire any thoughts you've had prior and know that you are what you focus on. Focus.